Welcome to the short video on Epicor Enterprise Asset Management. In this video, we plan to introduce you to an Epicor customer and then give a quick overview of some of our problems we solve and our capabilities around Epicor Asset Management. And then we'll have a brief screen share and demonstration of some of the key capabilities. Let's get to it. I wanted to kick things off and talk about one of our innovative customers, Boers & Company. They are based in the Netherlands and specialize in precision engineering, sheet metal, and mechatronics. And they were an early adopter of some of our more innovative enterprise asset management capabilities. Specifically, they were one of our early IoT customers. They have got a great story around what drove their interest in our IoT capabilities around asset management. A few years ago, they had an incident where an auxiliary machine that provided hydraulic oil had a major leak on the night shift. And the result was that there was hydraulic oil all over the shop floor when people came in in the morning and machine breakdowns where there were critical component failures. That meant that they were down from a production standpoint for several days and were unable to fill some customer requirements. It was a very costly incident but it also affected their reputation, which as you can imagine, they were very sensitive to. Moving forward, they never wanted that to happen again. And the answer to their problem was IoT. That auxiliary machine now has a simple fluid level sensor on it that connects to the Epicor IoT hub. And they also connected almost 100 other things in the areas of maintenance, quality, and safety. Enterprise asset management is critical to our customers because it provides powerful insights into how their assets are performing, both in the shop as well as in the field. Epicor provides various methods to collect and dissect information regarding asset performance, cost, and utilization. Capabilities within Epicor are designed to help manufacturers and service organizations maintain equipment, optimize customer service, and keep all technicians and customer support personnel informed. This slide shows some of the issues that Epicor Enterprise Asset Management capabilities are designed to address, as well as along the bottom of the slide, you can see the capabilities that Epicor has. Some of these capabilities will be what one would expect from an ERP solution, but take note of some of the more innovative features like IoT, digital twin, and edge computing. Let's have a look at some of the capabilities of our enterprise asset management solution. Assets and equipment inside of Epicor can track lower level serial numbers or child assets inside the asset to help keep maintenance and repair templates up to date across the entirety of the asset. Tracking both maintenance logs and maintenance costs, as well as meter readings and calibrations where necessary. Customers can also leverage our advanced MES tool for direct connections to the PLC. Where that's not possible, Epicor provides a proprietary MIU, or machine interface unit, to connect to those machines. The output is valuable real-time monitors to know exactly how assets are running, measure the quality and throughput, as well as get valuable metrics such as mean time before failure and mean time to repair. Advanced MES can also provide a holistic view of the shop and create timelines, commonly referred to as digital twins, to allow a replay of a point in time to see what took place in the shop. Both discrete and process manufacturers can start to understand any resources that are starved, or blocked from maximum throughput using the digital twin replay functionality. Key performance indicators can also be tracked by asset or asset group through this tool. The Internet of Things has created a great way for Epicor customers to take their first step in monitoring asset activity and automating processes. Assets can be monitored and notifications can be sent out if machines go down or go offline. The, crea the creation of maintenance jobs can be automated 
and planners can get col collaboration alerts or emails to help them adjust to the changing capacity in their shops when they experience downtime or unplanned work stoppages. Oftentimes, assets are designed and built internally. When that's the case, Epicor's project management structure is able to track progress against work breakdown structure phases and roll the estimates and costs to the top level. Many customers will leverage PLM integrations or CAD integrations such as CADLINK to push engineering designs directly to Epicor. Our robust CAD integration can touch several areas of the application to help reduce data entry, errors, and increase data accuracy. CAD files can be pushed directly to the engineering workbench area of the system, the estimating and quoting area of the system, or directly to work orders either in the planning phase or WIP. That can happen both on an individual level or on a project level to help roll those costs all the way to the top. Projects can also provide for various types of revenue recognition rules and project billing types by project phase to create a flexible way to capitalize the asset or invoice the customer. An auxiliary benefit of capturing asset design and manufacture inside of Epicor is the ability for customers to capture and categorize time spent by all personnel, whether it be engineering or manufacturing, to help claim tax credits for research and development efforts. Mobile applications can be used to capture time and expenses directed to the project or project phase, and workflow can be created to approve these submissions. Field service calls whether planned, like preventative maintenance, or unplanned, like break-fix scenarios, can be recorded and dispatched in Epicor. Oftentimes, case management capabilities are leveraged to tie the asset back to a production job, a shipment, an order, a quote, or even an asset number inside of the system. From there, troubleshooting questions can be asked choosing from a topic string to help customer service personnel provide valuable insight to the service technicians. Dispatching can be done through the use of dynamic scheduling boards that provide GPS visibility into customer sites, assets in the field, technicians, and even mobile inventory such as trucks or vans. Technicians can interact with new appointments in real time using the purpose-built application on their phone or tablet and relay acknowledgement information of an appointment or capture images and signatures and parts causing failure into the field, all of which can be relayed back to the back office in real time. Inspection lists allow for the technician to put data into the application and transmit it to the back office to help produce service summary documentation in a more timely and efficient fashion. Any images and signatures captured in the field can be included in that report. Thank you for joining to learn about what Epicor has to offer in enterprise asset management. Enterprise asset management is critical to our customers, both for their own internal assets and also, our innovative customers are extending things to assets they make and sell. Epicor customers are doing a lot of interesting things with the tools we provide, such as building and selling intelligent assets equipped with IoT sensors, and then creating a subscription-type service business where the asset can call home when there is a problem, before a customer even realizes there is something wrong. Then we can send out an engineer who can deliver on any SLA promises. In summary, Epicor helps you increase uptime by understanding how your assets are performing and alerting you to a maintenance issue before it becomes a problem. It can help improve quality, visibility, performance, and helps to empower our customers' employees.